Hello, I'm Bonnie Maxwell, and we're on the scissor case right now. I, we just got, got done making another video, and I noticed a dangerous thing that should never happen here in your household, or public places, or just anywhere. You know, it's just really dangerous. Scissors laying on the floor, I saw, right in the same spot. I haven't moved it at all. So I was walking to get to my accessories over there, and I saw the scissors laying on the floor. <laughs> I didn't know why it was on the floor. I don't remember what I... Oh. I remember I was cutting up my Jewish hat. That's it. Ah, good job, <laughs> So yeah, I found the scissors on the floor, and I thought I should make a video about it, saying how it's bad to have scissors laying on the floor. <laughs> So, I'm going to show you how to put a scissors away because we don't really need this anymore. So, yeah. So, we pick up the scissors. <laughs> Those were two. <laughs> oh, and don't have the blade. Have it facing down like this. And walk towards your destination. <laughs> Mine's over here. And you just put it back where it belongs. And yeah, that's how you put scissors away with Bonnie Maxwell. Now I'm going to do some French dancing! <laughs> dun, 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 dun. to my ex. <laughs> so, I got some utensils here. I don't know if you know them. This is called a notebook. You have pages in them and you just like draw and stuff. You know, it's your ordinary notebook. <laughs> and then this is a pack of markers. See how nice this pack of markers is? 
yeah, it's pretty nice. It has Oh, it has fit. fit. <laughs> it's coming the mark. Oh, whoops. It's coming the markers. But I remembered it was on the marker label. So just look at the label. <laughs> and it'll tell you how many markers so you don't have to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You know, you know that. Yeah. So this is my pack of markers. <laughs> Next, we have tape. You can use this and you just go like. Like this, and then like that. And then you can like tape stuff, like your finger. Nope, if you have it broken, you don't want to get it splintered anymore, you gotta tape it up. So that's tape. And then we have a coloring paper pad. Little kids really like to use this. <laughs> For like, if they're like learning how to write at first, they like write on the lines. And then they cap capitalize in lowercase, you know that stuff? Yeah. And then we have tie-dye kind of paper. And then we have some glossy white paper for like cool artwork projects. And then we kind of have, ooh, neon colors. It's pretty pretty, pretty pretty. And we have transparents for when little kids don't know how to really draw that well. They like copy stuff. So yeah, that's a pretty good way. And this is a pen. You open it up and you write <laughs> stuff on it. And yeah, that's my arts and crafts. I hope we come again for a randomness with Bonnie Maxwell. Toodles. Hi.